Hi, this is Village Boy. Thank you so much for making time. Would you believe that if I should tell you there's a community in this valley, very deep right here? Would you believe? Would you believe? Yes, there's a community called Akuma Nsuiti. It's in the Upper Mayakoba district of the Eastern region. How do they make work? Do they have access to telecommunication network in this village, in this typical village? Do they have? If they don't have, let's find out how they make calls in this village here. And it's going to be interesting. You need to follow this video till the end. And you're going to find out how things are done in this village. This is a forest which, which uh, there are houses inside the forest. But you can't actually see it because of the vegetation. Let's find out and keep watching till the end. Village Boy is here to take you around our villages. Keep watching. Like I'm losing my mind. Is everybody in the world blind? Please, Lord, give me a sign, a sign. I feel like I'm losing my mind. Is everybody in the world blind? Please, Lord, give me a sign, a sign. I wanna be the greatest. Everybody on the face shit. I look around and feel like everybody is the fakest. I make this every day and I'm impatient. Hoping one day I blow up from the basement. Statement, the top is so vacant. I don't need shit that I think is amazing. Waiting for my day when I'm playing. Sold out shows for a thousand faces. Hey, give me that crown. Get in my way and to be put down. It ain't your place. All this my town. If I want that shit, then I'll get it right now. I'm losing it. The noose it fits. I'm losing shit. A stupid myth. You choose to live or choose to dip. You choose to fight or lose your grip and lose a gift. Oh. I feel like I'm losing my mind Is everybody in the world blind? Please, Lord, give me a sign A sign I feel like I'm losing my mind Is everybody in the world blind? Please, Lord, give me a sign A sign Yeah! There's no mercy in this world, just hunger, thirsty persons In different versions, each do what they, that shit worsens Why? Pull back the curtain and you'll see the different vermin We all have different burdens that all seem to cause disturbance Yo, so do me a favor, don't treat me like a neighbor don't Hello, what's up people? This is Village Boy, Akuma Nsuiti Boga, Akuma Nsuiti Village Boy here talking to you right now on Village Boy YouTube channel If today happens to be your first time, who has an honest subscribe and for share our content to the rest of the world and today i want you to see or we are going to find out how the people in akuma and suiti here make calls or serve the internet this is ghana west africa follow me as i take you to where they actually make call the unfortunately i am using this video to, uh, this phone to record the video so you might not see the phone that i'm using to make the call but that's where i go and make calls or serve the internet and of course this is my house Village boy, let's go. We are moving. Yeah, well. we are moving gradually. So this video is going to be on cut. There is no way I'm going to cut it. But we are going to have full time. Full time watching this video where we actually make calls. So making call here in a village is like, you know, you have to put, put on your garment, right? Your one into boots, your cutlass and move to where we actually get network access or access point and it's super crazy here in a village you know regardless of your age you still have to go to that extent before you can actually hear from your people or your family members in a city that's so crazy super crazy right here and uh, one another unfortunate thing is that in our community here Students are not having um, access to network to actually learn, right? It's actually affecting the entire community, but for the student, I think it's paramount. Something that's supposed to be available for the children to use to learn. That in a village, none. Teachers are not having access to it. And another unfortunate thing is that you do this... Uh, uh, not... <laughs> What am I saying? Another unfortunate thing, very, very unfortunate, is that in our common city here, there's no electricity. So, as I'm going to access point, I'm going to an ask. Do I have to put it an access point? God damn it, bro. This is not English. <laughs> as I'm going to an access point, 
or a coverage area let me put it that way a coverage area right now when my phone battery runs down i need to leave the place and go to other communities you have to walk miles miles before you can actually charge your cell phone and unfortunate thing at that place where they actually have electricity they don't have network so that place to the same struggle that you need to go through before you can have a telecommunication network to either make calls or serve the internet that is crazy this is village akuma and suiti we are moving like i told you from the beginning this video is going to be on cut we are going to see the struggle i go through here and today i decided to take you to that very particular place for you to see how things goes on here in the village oh yeah as i'm moving you see beautiful things all right this is the footpath here this is crazy when we find something we think it's good we just plug it we eat as i'm moving if i see any cocoa i can actually plug it or purple i can actually plug it here in the village when you see anything of that sort that you are you want to consume you don't actually i mean here to take it you will have to take it when you, when you see the owner of that plot of land you tell the person i went for your this and the person will say okay there's nothing that a person will do to you either to summon you or to kill you no 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 here here is peaceful i come and see it is peaceful <laughs> i'm loving this moment we're still working keep watching the video yeah one thing that can let us grow faster is that as you are watching, you share. As you are watching, you share. Uh, you know, uh, sharing the video will make us grow faster. The subscribers, the views, the watch hours. And then we can actually make, um, what do you call it? A lot of views as well as the subscribers and we'll meet the requirement for monetization. I always tell you that in the village, there's so much problems to be solved. So many problems. So much. So many. Yeah, so help me bring that impact or that life-changing and transforming moment in my village here. Come and see it. Someone may ask, how am I filming myself right now as I'm walking? <laughs> I've improvised. I've actually improvised. So I have my stick. I don't know if it is appearing in the video right now. But I have my stake right here. Yeah. Oh, these are insects. I have my stick with me. I'm holding it with one hand. It's almost getting tired. But I'll still I'll keep on. I'll keep on till 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 till. I'll keep on. Yeah. I'll keep on. Holding it because for the love of the work and for the love of what i do i want you to see everything that happens here that's why i'm doing this i'm alone here and uh, i don't have videographer where the person can actually be taking me while i move comfortably that i can talk yeah we are still moving though this is to make call you know you can sit in the comfort of your home in your comfort of your office, in your bathroom, in your washroom, everywhere you find yourself. If you are fortunate enough, you have access to do these things, these basic social amenities like electricity, telecommunication network, especially a network, anywhere. You can actually have access to it. But here, impossible. It is impossible. <laughs> you can actually do anything in the community. With a session that you move to the outskirts of the community, and that is going to give you the, I mean, the way, the way to, to actually have access to it. It's all crazy, yeah? I just want you to see the top view of me whilst I'm walking. There's other things. There are some things here. Let me pass and then before I raise my camera. Yeah. Village boy is showing you the village. All right, so you can be watching me whilst from the top. How are you seeing the view? Beautiful, right? We are crossing a stream right now. This is super crazy. It is super crazy because to make a call, you have to cross stream, stream of water. Gee, this is crazy. We are finding out how the people in Akuma and Suiti make calls. 
And this is crazy. To make a call, you need to cross a stream of water. And not just after crossing the stream that you have access to the network, but you have to walk. You still have to walk distance. Oh, jeez. This is, this is crazy. Huh? My God. Oh, no, 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 no. Huh? I can't, I can't actually think forward. I can't actually think well. I can't think far. This is super crazy, dude. Huh? It is so easy oh, to be in a village. You know, when you come to Akuma City, the community is so peaceful. That's one of the assurance. It's so peaceful, so wonderful. So if you happen to, I mean, visit Akuma City, there's nothing. Huh? What is that? Is it here where you can be walking and you meet bush, bush, bush meat? <laughs> ah, you can be walking while you meet bush, bush meat. Those of you who enjoy your favorite. I've lost what I, I am even saying. I've lost it. Okay, let me let me continue. So if you happen to visit Akuma City, you know there's nothing absolutely to worry about. Alright, when it comes to peace, serenity, alright? It's so serene, it's so peaceful, it's so quiet. The people are welcoming, they're jovial. You know, all those things you have. You have them already. This is an assurance I've given to you. But the only problem we are facing currently in a village is accessibility to the business social ministers. Those are the things that we are actually facing, which is actually affecting the people of Akuma City. Let me give you a, a brief history about Akuma City. So Akuma City has been in existence for... I'm, I'm beginning to climb a mountain here. Damn, bro. Damn, bro. Maybe you want to see a back view of me. Let me turn my camera. You can actually see it. Let me put this one here. Okay. Okay, I think you can see it right now. Okay, so let's go. Let me put the camera right like this. Okay, beautiful. Damn, bro. This is damn. Damn, bro. So, and I'll come and see it in here. This community has been in existence for more than 150 years. So it is not a new settlement. So those of you who are thinking that this place is a new settlement, no, actually, it's never a new settlement. It's an, a very old community. We have a, a pooling station. We vote, we exercise our franchise right, during general elections. So meaning that we partake in a national decision-making process. And so that's one alone should just you or should tell you that this community has also been, uh, they needed the support from our leaders. Beautiful. And so, when we are crying for the basic social amenities, our leaders need to listen and listen attentively. All right? And this community, it was discovered through hunting. That is according to my, uh, my father. He said his, his grandfather, that is four forefathers, told them that, they first settled at Sekisia and through hunting, they discovered this place. So when they got here, those days, the water, the water situation here is so, it's pretty good. So they discovered that and he went and told his family members, some came here to settle and later others joined and they have really developed this place into a community. And right now we can, we can actually see uh, what do you call it? People living here and doing fantastic for themselves. And we have a few graduates from Akuma and Sweetie. Myself, I'm a graduate of UCC. I'm a graduate of UCC, you know that. <laughs> They're still moving. You see how I'm breathing? Huh. It's so crazy. We are still moving. We've not gotten to where we are going. I just want you to see my face, right? We've not gotten to where we are going. This is to make a call in our village. This is crazy. I've never seen this before in my life. I've never seen and I've ne I cannot even, you know, <laughs> what should I say? I shouldn't say I've never seen this because I, um, I've been uh, living with this situation for more than uh, two decades now, right? So I would say that if I happen to be in a city, 
and I have access to all these basic social amenities and someone is telling me this story, I'll be like, yo, dude, what you're saying is absolutely not true. But until, until I, I come to the community to discover it by myself, I won't believe. But right now, <laughs> uh, I'm seeing it. So we are still climbing up. This is the footpath I'm using to get to that place. Let's check it out. Let's check it out. We have some oranges here. I don't feel for oranges like I would have plucked some. I don't feel for some. Look at it. Yes, look at it. Beautiful, right? I don't feel for some. That is why. But here you can actually plug it for free. It's for someone. But later on, I'm going to tell the person. I felt like, you know, enjoying orange and I took some of your orange. So if you go there and you realize that there's a changes in your tree, it's me. The person will be like, wow, it's good. Don't worry. I got you. So in a village, it's so peaceful. The people are so loving. I would want to welcome you all, those of you watching us across the group, welcome you all to Akuma Nzuiti. In whatever way, in cash and in kind, whatever way you can use to support this community, we are just advocating for your support. Kindly do us the favor and support Akuma Nzuiti today. You can actually pick one child from Akuma Nzuiti and start to I mean, sponsor the person education. I have a serious student here that when they have those opportunities, I think they are going to make good use of those resources and it's going to help them accelerate faster. Let me check if my video is recording because I don't want a problem. Okay, so my video is still recording. Okay, so I'm still working. Uh, I'm still working. Let's go. I'm um, sorry for the inconveniences if the camera is shaking because you know my stick is very long. I don't have. If I have someone who is to take me, like it would have been easier and nice. I just want you to see this mountain right here. Is it full of rock? How are you going to see it? Let me put the camera this way. Can you see it now? Can you see it? I don't know if you can see it. Okay, can you see it? Can you see it now? I believe you are seeing it right now. Ah! <laughs> so we are still moving. Let's keep moving. Climbing another mountain. We've climbed the first one. Very, uh, that one is short. Very short. Akuma Zoo community has a population of more than 500 people in a community. And if all of them that left for the city uh, to come back we would have been more than that a lot a lot of people here and uh, these people they are much 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 more into agriculture production they produce varieties of crops like cocoa banana plantain uh, cocoa yam cassava maize we process curry here so it's a pr primary production we do primary production here or uh, secondary production because curry processing is secondary i think secondary production yeah <sighs> So I'm still moving. I'm walking a bit faster because of the duration of the video. I don't want to waste much of your time. I just want you to see the struggle we go through. And it's not actually the only place that you have to walk very far distance before you can actually have access to network. But there are some other places where the mountain is so steepy. So, so steepy and deep and difficult, troubling to climb. Ah, I'm even tired, bro. I'm even tired, bro. So we are finding out. This video is about finding out how the people of Akuma City make us, the struggle they go through, the stress. <laughs> Gee, damn, bro. So in Akuma City, we are actually in the electoral area. This electoral area composed of four Odome, Jisutapon, Agbeze, Tradonko, and Akuma City itself. So we have one assembly member who represent this, these communities. It's a worsome, well right? Good. <laughs> you see, I'm sweating. I don't know if, if the camera is able to picture or capture my sweat right now. I'm sweating. Ah, oh, damn, bro. What am I? Come and see your village boy. Come and see your village boy suffering. Another stress. This is, this is too much pressure. Too much pressure. 
I just want you to know. Look at how I'm sweating. Damn. Damn, bro. <coughs> oh. Oh. Eradia. Okay, so let, let, let me show you something before we continue the journey. We have not gotten to the place yet, but I just want to show you something right now. The view, when you stand on the top of this mountain, the view that you are going to actually see, it's so nice. So I just want you to see it. Are you feeling me? Appreciate my video, like my video and share. All right, so now let's stand. Let's stand right now. Okay, so... As you can see, at my very back here, is a valley and it stretches down to this very part here where you can actually see the settlement of Akuman City that has structures over there. But here people come to farm, Akuman City people come to farm here in this valley. We have cocoa, we have banana, we have timbers, we have, uh, 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 what do you call it, uh, uh, palm plantation over there. I don't know if the camera is the Kamala. It's able, to, <laughs> it's able to capture it very well for you to see. Fantastic. So um, this is a beautiful view. I think a majority of you or those of you watching me right now, you will be so much, so much amazed to see. And you would love to be here in Akuma and Suiti. I'm ready to take you around. Just look at me. You see my food here? You see me right now? <laughs> All right, so let's continue our journey. We are going to make call, so let's continue our journey. But unfortunately, I will not be able to get a different. I was not. I was not having a phone. Uh, I'm. I'm gonna tell you. I'm not having a phone on me right now to make a call for you to see. But I'm taking you to the place I mostly come to surf the internet as well as make a call. So let's keep moving. This work. You need effort and energy. Buy me some toffee, one dollar. One dollar toffee. Alright. But in, in place of toffee, buy me buy me a digital camera if you think you are you you are, you are in a capacity to do that. Yeah. Yes. It's super crazy. We are still moving. Never stop watching. Oh, I'm I'm taking you right to the place, to the access point. And uh, I just want you to see the stress we go through. So one, sometimes, because you don't have any, anyone here to confirm if the network is stable, sometimes the weather can distract it. So you come here, you that, you, 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 you'll be like, you know, if I come here, let me, let me let, let, or if I come here, I'm going to get access to network to make my calls. Charlie, damn, bro. You come here and there's no network. Even the way we mostly, or sometimes come to make calls, you come here and there is absolutely no network no network emergency and you have to walk back like the same way you walked in you have to walk back like the same thing it's super crazy and very annoying sometimes as a content creator i would want to upload a video you know like 10 a 10 minute duration but it will not be able to upload it why because the network is not strong all right so it will take you a very long time like the following day so if you look at all those kind of challenges then you have to resort to different places sometimes i walk to a place called kohum almost close to a hemiji market this market you can use like two hours to get there and when you get to kohum the rest of the journey will be like uh, within 30 minutes you can get there so you could imagine the rest of the hours you used to walk to that place to do whatever you want to do it's super crazy i appreciate my work okay? so, but still i never gave up uh, i am still maintaining the consistency of putting uploading creating videos you know uh, what's actually happening in the village and putting it out there for you to see village boy is not here to give up village boy is forever here to serve you bring you the content you would love to see in our villages and also have positive impact in our villages like what Wadamaya is actually doing for humanity west africa not only west africa but africa in general Wadamaya always inspire me 
So village boy will never give up. And there's nothing that will, uh, can, uh, can actually discourage me. You know, and then I would use this opportunity as well to plead with all philanthropists, NGOs, uh, governmental agencies, non-governmental agencies that are in a capacity of assisting our Kumen Suiti to have it, I mean it, um, what do you call it? Um, hey, my brother Nasa. To have it, it firm standing again, let me put it that way, it firm standing again to help the people live a better life in a village because we produce a lot different different things right now you can see someone this is someone's maze maze farm let me put the camera on my back right now okay okay so this is someone's maze farm and uh this is the self Ghana you are in a city someone is producing this are going to enjoy ourselves and that's one thing we want to ensure food security in the country and uh the people here, they are very, very industrial. So having access to the basic social amenities are electricity, portable water health facility, road network, telecommunication network. It's going to have a positive impact. It's going to have a very, very positive impact in their lives. And I'll urge all of you individuals who are watching me right now to take it as a responsibility to do this for us. I'm begging you. I'm begging you in the name of God. I'm begging you in the name of God, please help me. Help village boy, help village boy. I'm begging you. <sighs> so we are almost close to the place. It's super crazy. I hope you've enjoyed yourself while watching this video and you are appreciating the fact that we go through stress and I know definitely you are going to share this content. If you are not sharing this content or you, you, you know good like, you won't share this content then i don't know what to say again but i hope and i trust that you're going to share it for others to also get to watch so actually from this point you can start having a very low signal from here where well, i've actually got into this like this uh this is palm palm tree right you can actually start getting your uh signal but it's very 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 uh what do you call it slow so as you move towards ahead as you move ahead let me put it that way as you move ahead you can start having a strong at least intermediate intermediate signal that will help you um what do you call it solve the internet or make calls so like i said this has been the struggle that we go through here by making calls Surfing the internet and whatsoever we want to do, these are some of the things we go through here. Come and see it. I've already told you that this video is going to be on cut, so there's not going to be editing too much editing on this because I just want you to have a feel of how things goes on here in the village. Once again, my name is Village Boy, and thank you so much for making time by joining me on Village Boy YouTube channel and watching this video and sharing at the same time, subscribing to the channel. And uh, so from here, or here, I would say you have an intermediate signal, which is not all that strong as an advanced. So thank you so much for making time by watching my videos. I appreciate you all. This is Village Boy. If you have any support, kindly support Village Boy. Let's go together. Let's join hands together. Let's mobilize resources together to have a positive impact in the lives of people in our villages. I'll see you again. Big ups. Peace.